reflecting on this topic, I thought of times of struggle. And I, then I thought of times that when my life was perfect, I opened up and looked in. Right now, it's strong, strong with me to share an example. It's 2009. I'm in Hawaii. I'm very successful in life, various careers, businesses. I had the toys. I had this beautiful truck that I bought in 2003. I bought a Harley that I bought in 2005. And I golfed three, four times a week, sometimes hopping the outer islands just for the day to golf. And yet, there was this black hole in my chest and my, my, my center, emptiness, depression, lack. I was going to sleep crying. I was waking up in, in tears, full on tears. And I'm like, what is wrong? I should be happy. I should be flying high. Um, went to the, the therapist even. They kind of like, I don't know what's wrong. <laughs> and they kind of sent me on my way. I'm like, wow, thanks. That was helpful. Um, so I went to a sacred place that I feel very uh, connected to the all that is on Oahu. <clears throat> it's a beach on the west side and very secluded. And I stayed there for like three, four days. And I cried and I yelled and was on my knees. What do you want me to do? I don't know who I was talking to, but I knew I was talking to something beyond myself. I was talking to the waves, the moon, the dolphins, the sand. And then there was a shift. There was a shift of weight. Gravity changed. I felt lighter, I felt weightless. And my arms just went out and open. Looking back so many times since then, trying to evaluate what was that, what was happening. This month makes 10 years I've been committed to and part of this ministry in this community of Sunrise Ranch, 10 years. It's a fourth of my life, <laughs> exactly. And every time I go back to that moment, I'm in that moment, in this moment. <clears throat> I was sharing about it a bit last night with some friends. My current realizations around this is that I was so focused on being a masculine energy in my life. The doing, the doing, the doing, penetrate, accomplish. That when I got the message in 2009, better yourself and be of service. I was like, I'm pretty good already. I can rock anything. Give me what do you want. What do you want me to do? I'll learn it. I'm going to accomplish it. I'm going to perfect it. You know? <laughs> it wasn't doing that I was being asked. It was being opening up, bringing the beingness into the doingness in balance. And when I did that physically, mentally and emotionally on my knees, after letting go of the anger and angst, the, the, the grabbing at my world, what's the answer? I allowed it to flow, it came. And that, that's still flowing through me. And they answer Morse every moment. 